Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to another episode of my River Guide French edition for Corsica. The fungo is an often unknown treasure. The standard section is from Manso to the small bridge above the hamlet with the road branch towards Porto. The put in at Manso is not the most upper possibility, but directly above there is a portage and often water levels are too low for a put in further up. The cars can be parked on the river left while the put in is across the bridge. There's not much time to warm up as it starts with a quite steep and narrow cataract. After this heavy start it becomes easier as the riverbed widens which also makes the water shallower. This can mean that low water levels up here are not much fun. The gorge is located at the put out across the bridge and about 200 meters upstream. 70 centimeters are the minimum. This here is slightly above. A middle level is reached at 90 centimeters and high flows are at 1 meter 20. The electronic gorge is updated seldomly, so one best judges it by looking at the ASCO. If it has good to much water, the fungo is running as its source is at the other side of the mountain range. Water levels on the fungo are dropping fast, so the time window is narrow. The fungo is a bit of the most treaded pass in terms of kayaking. Located in the northwest of the island, it is 90 minutes away from Ponte Leccia and at least two hours from Porto. The fungo is better known to tourists as a bathing river in the hot season, when there are only puddles left. If the water levels are low, one can also enter at a nature parking at a river turn at the end of the shallow stretch. From here on it becomes more challenging up to Whitewater 4 with a bit more water. The entry rapid thunders down steeply into a flat pool which has a huge rock in the middle. You can pass it on either side. As the road is right above you can take a look on your way up. It continues in a similar fashion as above only now more confined in rock walls of a greyish color as opposed to the red formations at the start. The riverbed is now much more confined, but most rapids still end in a pool after a more or less steep descent, at least at this water level. This rapid has a hidden rock that could mess up your route on the left, so it's better to approach right anyway. The last few hundred meters flow into a narrow rock channel that defines the characteristic of this part. The entry is open with a rock plate that is about one meter above the lower pool. At low levels the channel on the right is also possible. It becomes very sticky with more water. Now that the exit is near, the fungo once more shows everything. It starts with a funnel that is sticky in the down below and is followed by a hole across the whole river width at the awkward angle. You can find additional information down in the description. If you found this guide helpful, please consider leaving a like and if you don't want to miss the next video, hit the subscribe button. Until then, goodbye!